Have you ever been hugged by a black woman? Arms so tight around body, smelling like whatever ingredient they use to overcome adversity. When a black man calls you sister, it is a reminder that we are part of something bigger, something loving, something unconditional. We have this gift. Well, we can create magic from the most minimal amount of ingredients in the kitchen. Where we can create laughter where detriment appears to be the only joke. And in times of despair, just mix in some melanin and the outcomes hope we laugh like we deserve to. Like we are free. From the tops of our heads to the pits of our bellies. And no, this isn't about struggle or anguish or low self-esteem. This is about how my mum can make a pot for four, feed 16. This is about my nan asking me to get the ting from the ting and knowing exactly what she means. This is about joy about being broke but never being broken. This isn't about silver spoons and wide open doors. This is about feeding ourselves or kicking doors open. This is about Sunday dinners, macaroni cheese and three different types of meat. This is about not having to explain why we need roast potatoes, white rice and rice and peas. This is about not having to explain what oxtail is, even though that feels kind of self-explanatory. This is about calling everyone auntie and having no idea how they're family. This is about our legacy. And I'm not talking slave ships, athletes or entertainers. This is about cataract surgery, 3D effects, blood banks and creating magic from the shit that they gave us. This is about my hair as something that is curly and versatile and free. This is about my body, but not under ownership, as something that belongs to me. This is about soca and Afrobeats and not being able to help but to dance to the rhythm. This is about growing up, watching my parents slow wind at a party way past my bedtime, so slow that it requires precision. This is about the joy they would like us to forget that we have, or the happiness they would like us not to remember we possess. This is about black joy, black hope, black peace and black love, and all the beauty that lies in my blackness.